Hello and welcome to Pabli. In this video, we are going to understand how to add Facebook leads detail in Google Sheets automatically within minutes. So here my objective is every time a Facebook lead is captured, then automatically I want that those details should be added in my spreadsheet. To do this, we'll be integrating the two applications using Pabli Connect. The trigger will be Facebook lead ads and our action application will be Google Sheets. Now to understand how you can integrate and automate this entire process yourself, Without the need of any coding skills, let's begin. So this here is the dashboard of Pabli Connect and you can reach here by clicking on the link which is given in the video description. Once you reach here on the right hand side, there's a tab create workflow. Click on this and here you have to name your workflow. I'm going to name it as per my objective, which is to add Facebook leads detail in Google Sheets automatically. Once we have selected the folder here, I have selected create and now you can see that we have reached another window. This window has got two extremely important events. One here, this trigger, another one is action. Now triggers and actions are basically those two principles or concepts on which this entire automation works. Trigger is when this happens, action says do this. Basically action here is the automated response of your trigger application. So here, as per my objective, the trigger application will be Facebook lead ads and the trigger event is new lead instant. So every time you receive a new lead, instantly this workflow is going to run. Let's click on connect. I have already logged into my Facebook account. Here I'm going to select add new connection, connect with Facebook lead ads. And as we do that, here we can see that the authorization has been successful, which means Facebook lead ads account and Pabli Connect are integrated. Now, as I scroll down here, we have to select the page and the lead generation form associated. So this here is my Facebook page and I'm going to go to the various pages that I have created. So let's say that here we are talking about Elegance Fitness Studio. So this here is a page that I have created and I want to promote this page. So I'm going to select this same page here, which is Elegance Fitness Studio. And since there is only one lead generation form associated, so it has already been populated by the system. Now we have to capture the lead. So please ensure that your lead generation form has to be live. Click on save and send test request. Now what we have to do is we have to do a test submission so that the data can be recorded here in the webhook response. For this, I'm going to take you to Meta for developers to receive a test lead. Let's go to my applications. Here we are going to go to tools and within tools we have lead ads RTU debug tool. Here I'm going to use this tool to test the API integration and we can create a test lead to confirm that our integration is set up to receive data correctly. Here I'm going to select the page which is Elegance Fitness Studio and now here I'm going to click on preview form. Now here's the forms right in front of us and now we are going to fill up the form. Let's say the first name here is smart. The last name is dummy. Then we have the email which is smart at pablitudes.com and then we have the phone number which is now I'm going to click on next and submit as soon as the form is submitted here we have to check if we have received the response and we can see that the webhook response has been captured here and we have received all the details that we had just filled in and now I want that these details should be added in my spreadsheet. So here I have already created a spreadsheet. The name is Elegance Fitness Studio Leads and we have three columns, name, email address and contact number. So here what I'm going to do, I'm going to choose my action application as Google Sheets. Let's click on this. Then we have the action event here. It will be add new row, connect. And as we do that here, Pabli Connect wants to connect with Google Sheets account, select add new connection, sign in with Google. And here we are going to choose an account with which our spreadsheet is linked. And once this is done, Pabli Connect Sheet wants to access my Google account. Let's click on allow. This is absolutely secure. And here we can see that the authorization has been successful. And once this is done, now here we have to fill in this information. First of all, we have to select the name of the spreadsheet. So here it is Elegance Fitness Studio Leads. And since there was only one sheet, so you can see it has already been populated by the system. Now we have to enter this information, the same information we had received here in the previous step. Now we are going to use a method which is known as mapping for this. As I click here, you can see the previous step here. And now this here is the name, give us space and this here is the last name. Now this method is called mapping and this is important so that every time your workflow runs in real time with some new information, that new information can be taken into account. 
Next, we have to map the email address and then we have to map the contact number. Once this is done, here I'm going to click on save and send test request. And as we do that, here we have received the response. So now let's go and check out our spreadsheet and you can see that we have got the details here. So this means our integration is a complete success. Let's check the same in real time. So I'm going to take you back to lead ads testing tool and here I'm going to fill out another form. Now let's say the first name here is dummy. The last name is demo. Then we have the email which is dummy at pablitudes.com. Then we have the mobile number. Let's click on next and submit. Now, as soon as this is submitted, automatically the details should be captured here. And you can see that we have received the details. So this means our integration is a success, taking you back to Pabli Connect. Let's quickly understand what we have done. So here our trigger was Facebook lead ads. The event was new lead instant. And our action application was Google Sheets, where the event was to add new row. I hope this is absolutely clear to you. If in case you have any doubt, you can refer to the workflow. The same workflow is there in the description box of this video. Also, you can close the same and start to process immediately. Apart from this, if you have any specific integration to work on, you can always write to us. Not only this, but you can integrate multiple applications using Pabli Connect software. To ask any of your query, you have to write at forum.pabli.com. You can also visit our website, which is www.pabli.com slash connect. To get all the details about the latest updates, the integrations and applications, you can visit our Facebook group. If in case you have found this video helpful, then do not forget to share this with your friends and colleagues so that they can also get into automation and make their life easy. I'm going to see you very soon with different integrations and automations. Do not forget to like, share and subscribe. Take care of yourself.